Patrick, as you all know, you know Patty Lips. Um, but basically, this is going to be my first time ever getting programming from Patrick or from anyone in general. So I never had someone else do my training until now. This is really important for me because I'm taking full advantage of the next two years as a plan to have a full off season. And I want to optimize all that time to build strength and gain muscle. So I'm going to let Patrick take over and give you guys a rundown on the approach we're going to take and how it's going to align with my goals. So after the show, we reevaluated everything that uh, Eddie wants to achieve short term and long term and we created this plan from all of the dieting advice that I have provided he actually learned so much that he can intuitively eat right now so what we're gonna try and do is intuitively focus on getting protein in and intuitively focus on getting calories in and trying to gain one pound approximately a month so he's gonna check it on the scale see how the trend is moving over the week and then intuitively adjust okay well I need to get a little bit more calories and okay I need to get a little bit less in depending on the trend of the scale over a week span on the training side of things Eddie wants to get Get, um, a lot more serious that way where there's going to be more structure. He's following an overall progressive um, scheme, but it wasn't exact um, calculating every pound of volume, um, calculating um, every rep set, rest time, everything like that. So we're going to get more into detail following a structured periodized program. Um, we're going to be focusing on um, improving his physique, prioritizing uh, muscle groups to improve for his men's physique uh, WMBF debut eventually in two years to try and go for his men's physique pro card. There we're also going to focus on increasing his bench press and uh, of course his squat and deadlift as well since powerlifting is something uh, he enjoys but not necessarily something he wants to compete in the short term. But we are going to focus on bench press, going to do a little bit higher frequency, uh, focus on the upper shelf, on that V taper, of course the core area, and focus on those proportions. Overall I feel like this will be a different approach but better approach for where he is currently in his life. We are going to have that more bulking type mindset where we want to gain weight, we want to gain muscle, we want to get stronger. So we're shifting gears and focusing on long-term investing that look for a better overall package when we do hit the stage. Perfect. This is gonna be a good series because like a common thing that I struggled with when I first started getting into the gym was packing on size. So it's gonna show you guys what I'm eating as well. And of course, training, it is gonna be a different approach from a cutting training protocol. So it's, it's gonna be really interesting for me because I'm gonna learn, I feel like this is a new learning curve for me on how to train for a bulk now. Taking this to account, we want you guys to get value from following Eddie's journey. Of course, it's gonna be fun and interesting to see what he's doing, but we also want you to implement these principles into your lifestyle, into your training regimen. So what should these people expect to see from you um, during this bulking journey? Having a more balanced lifestyle and actually enjoying myself with the foods I eat. I won't, like Patrick was saying, I won't be tracking every gram, I won't be bringing up my scale, but I'll be intuitively eating, enjoying my foods, and if that means where I have to have a little belly fat around my stomach, so be it. If that's my balance, then I'm overall happy. So I'll show you guys the lifestyle, show you guys my training, and basically be more consistent with this whole thing, because I finally feel like I've found balance where I'm able to provide you guys good quality content and I'm able to throw more videos out there for you guys and show you guys what I'm up to. Alright, so um, it's going to be less of this interview style and I'm really excited to see the in-depth, the nitty gritty training, the nitty gritty nutrition aspect and see what you're actually doing and implementing in the future. It's going to be stoked to see and be coaching you in a different way now, yeah. more on the training side. Yeah, so it's going to be sick. Awesome. Stoked. Alright guys, so thanks for watching today's video. I know it's quick and simple. I know these sit downs are kind of boring, but next video is going to come out. It's going to be a legitimate vlog. Show sure you guys what my day looks like. Show sure you guys what I eat, how I train, and overall what I'm up to. So thanks so much for watching this video, and we'll see you guys in the next one.